Hey everybody, it's Mike. I'm here with Sarah Robertson and uh, Mrs. Robertson. Uh, I walked into your class and I got to see you working with some of your young ladies who are right here looking to see if you're going to mess up or not. So <laughs> we're going to see how it goes. Uh, but uh, we are very proud that you're on our staff and you are a recipient of our Staff Pride Award. Uh, and so if you could, first of all, tell me a little bit about your career. What landed you here? How long have you been here and all that good stuff? Well, I moved to Cincinnati in January of 1996, and I subbed in uh, the surrounding areas. Loveland never called me okay. uh, for the remaining six months of that year, and I got to know the area with my fold-out map. Uh, and thankfully, the following August, I was hired two days before school started um, as a fourth grade teacher, and nice. I've been teaching fourth grade for 27 years since then. Really? The same grade? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's I've had more impressive. consistency in my career than most teachers yeah. have had. And, and it's the, uh, the whole career has been here at Loveland. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wow. That's all fourth really cool. grade, all literacy and social studies. Yeah. yeah. What's your favorite part of the job? Ah, oh, working with my fabulous students. There I you think go. they know that. You guys can say yay. <laughs> yay! <laughs> but I really do love it. Even yeah. though I think some of my adult friends don't understand, who aren't teachers, don't yeah. understand that every day is different, every year is different, even though sure, you're yeah. still teaching the same grade. Sure. Yeah. 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 It keeps your brain moving. It's uh, in the kids and getting to know the kids. Tell me a little bit about your own family. Uh, I'm married to Derek, met him at OU. Uh, have a son who's a sophomore at OU, which is very miraculous that uh, he <laughs> made it to college. I have a daughter who's about to graduate uh, from Anderson High School. She's going to Ohio State, which has been a little bit traumatic since Derek and I are uh, Michigan fans. Are you um, really? Oh, Wait, yeah, uh, season ticket holder, we'll just met cut, the we'll Michigan cut, fans. Cut the video. <laughs> <laughs> no, awesome. uh, and then I have an eighth grade son oh, uh, at Nagel, who will be a freshman at Anderson oh, High School I didn't next realize year. That. Okay. And two dogs and two cats. I can't forget them. Okay, well. great. Uh, and so the silly question I'll ask you: We, I, I always pop in and we talk about music and concerts. What is the favorite favorite concert you have ever gone to? Oh my gosh, that's impossible. There are so many good ones. Uh, my husband and I joke that most of the people we see in concert are in their 70s, uh, so we are hoping they stick around for a whole lot longer. Yeah. Um, best concert ever. Gosh, we try to go to concerts as often as I we can. I know you do. Um, and in fact, I met you. The first time I met right. you was at a concert. Absolutely. What concert was it? I think it was um, Black Crows. I think it was. I think yeah. it was. Yeah. yeah. That's right. Um, I love outdoor concerts, but I also love concerts in the small venues, uh -huh. like Riverfront Live. Sure. Uh, we go there pretty regularly, yeah. or the Redmore in yeah. uh, Mount yeah. Washington. Uh -huh. Oh, I don't know. I What's your favorite, favorite genre of music, then? Rock. Rock. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Classic rock. Okay. Old school stuff. All right. Yeah. I like it. I like it. Well, I'm going to go ahead and read the nomination, and Sarah Robertson said, uh, the person who nominated said, if you want to witness an incredibly captivating educator just walk into Sarah's room. Her students are on the edge of their seat waiting for an unbelievable story or, an, or excited to learn whatever it is that she has to teach. She can make a grammar lesson into a party. <laughs> Sarah works closely with all of her students, bringing out the best in them. She genuinely loves her students and her team. Uh, and I've popped into your classroom enough to know that that is true, and I appreciate all that you do. Uh, and we're going to give you this uh, B. Loveland t-shirt and uh, I'm going to say thank you and do you have any last words that you would like to say? No, I just want to say thank you for this. Um, this is nice to be recognized. I really appreciate it. Well, you should. Thank you. Because you do a great job and uh, I said in, uh, I uh, interviewed another teacher earlier and we have about 250 teachers on staff and every single teacher I get to know and, and get to do these, it's amazing the individual stories and just the talent we have. Uh, I, I, I know the community appreciates it, but just how much I appreciate being a part of it. It's an awesome staff, just everybody I talk to. Is I love so my good. job, and yeah. I love Loveland, and I love being here. Well, it shows. Yep. Showing I up every it. day is a pleasure. Good. Well, uh, on three, we always say go Tigers. So one, two, three. Go, go Tigers! tigers.